House Majority Leader Rolando Andaya showed documents to prove allegations against Budget Secretary Ben Diokno. Diokno again denied that there were insertions in the budget and stood firm that he will not release the road user's tax. Royce Snagit has the story. Congress is already on Christmas break, but House Majority Leader Rolando Andaya called for a press conference Wednesday to answer Budget Secretary Benjamin Jocno's tirades on the road board abolition. Andaya clarified the decision of the lower house to rescind the House bill abolishing the road board was made after their meeting with President Duterte back in September. At uh, maliwanag po dun sa usapan namin, tinanong po namin siya kung ano ba talaga ang nais pong mangyari ng ating mahal na Pangulo doon po sa road board. Ipagpatuloy na raw po ang pag-release ng project. Yun po ang aming pagkaintindi at yun ang maliwanag na sinabi sa amin. Kaya po, winidraw na namin ang uh, panukalang batas na ito. Andaya also presented budget documents showing a total of 325 million funding for flood control projects in Kasiguran Sur Sugon, whose mayor is the father-in-law of Jokna's daughter. He said these projects are part of the 75 billion insertions of Jokno in the 2019 budget. Ano ba ho talaga yung basihan na pagbigay ho natin ng pondo para sa flood control? May master plan ba tayo? Uh, kamag-anak ba? O ala chamba ba? Secretary Jokno denied Andaya's allegations. I don't know him from Adam, okay? Ano inaakusahan nila yung yung daughter ko raw is related in, uh, my daughter is married to a sikat, okay? Married to a sikat. And, uh, his, and uh, his father died and yung mother niya remarried this Sorsogon politician. Jokno is also standing by his decision not to release proceeds from the road user's tax. Marami nang lumapit sa akin. I won't name names, no? Marami nang lumapit sa akin na politiko na tinatanong yung status nga ng road user's fund na yun. Kailan marirelease? And so forth. Sabi ko hindi ko i-release yan until that issue on the on the road board is settled. The House is set to conduct an inquiry into alleged anomalies in the 2019 budget in Sorsogon in January 3. Andaya said they would invite Chokno to attend the hearing, but it's up to the secretary if he would attend or not. For News 5, Royces Nagit, we are One News.